Okay, I'm back. Now let's get into the bottom shelf. And, um... Hey there. You gonna sit with me while I do my videos, Sam? Okay, um... Get this camera out of the way. Uh, Saving Private Ryan, which, um... People... Uh, a lot of people, including my dad, hate the ending. They say it ruins the movie, but I don't know. I really... I thought the ending didn't ruin it. I really do love this movie. Um, uh, Rocky, um... You got Rocky, and then the last Rocky movie, Rocky Balboa. Not seen the middle Rocky movies, but I think I might like them, except for Rocky Five. Um, Superman the movie. Um, uh, I didn't have anything to say about that. Um, Superman Two, which uh, again is another blind buy. And I do have Superman 3 and 4, but they're in a shelf hidden away in shame. Uh, oh, forgot about this. Uh, Tim Burton's Batman, which I'll get into um, once I see Batman Forever and Batman Robin again. Uh, the Dark Knight. Um, despite it not being my favorite superhero movie, uh, it is still a really, 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 really amazing film that's going to stand the test of time, as I mentioned in my review, which you should go check out right now instead of hearing me talk about The Dark Knight here. Um, Inception. Um, saw a film in class by David Cronenberg, um, X Descends, which reminded me very much of Inception, only weirder. And I think Inception is better, because I think Christopher Nolan's a better director than David Cronenberg, in my opinion. Uh... Yeah, about the stuff here. Um, I, Robot, which I have not seen... I believe I saw this movie in theaters, but I have not seen it since. Um, why, it's be, why it's being released on Blu-ray 3D, I have no idea. I mean, does it really need a 3D release? Oh, well. Uh, Pulp Fiction, one of the most quotable movies in existence. Really, really good. If you haven't seen it, what are you doing? Go see it. Uh, the Town Ultimate Collection, which I do have the uh, the box and all the supplements that came with it, but I don't know. I really love this movie. Um, obviously, I buy it because of the DVD, which camera's out of focus. There you go. Um, then, um, this one is really good. Uh, Mission Impossible Ghost Protocol. I've not seen the other Mission Impossible movies, but I'm almost nervous to because this one is so amazing. Uh, it's too bad he can't see. Too bad he can't see in the IMAX again because the IMAX was an amazing experience. Um, True Lies, which is a lot of people's least favorite James Cameron movie, but I don't know. James Cameron has never disappointed me, in my opinion. Uh, yet, <laughs> uh, Commando, which is another blind buy, but I kind of watched the Nostalgia Critics review for it to get the idea to buy it, and there you go. Um, <clears throat> Frank, uh, really crazy movie, and it's even more insane sequel, Crank 2, which is even better. Uh, but if you, if you're not into, like, crazy action movies, don't bother with these. Uh, Bill and Ted's excellent adventure. <laughs> and then the modern day Bill and Ted, uh, Harold and Kumar go to White Castle. Um, might do, we're thinking about, uh, an In-N-Out run. When we were in Santa Cruz, a lot of people and I were thinking about an in and out run to San Jose, because that's the nearest in and out to Santa Cruz, and it would just be like some weird ass adventure, but you know, really funny. Uh, Ghostbusters, my favorite comedy. Every time I see this movie, there is this gigantic grin on my face, kind of like this. Yeah, I'll try to refrain from that. Jimmy Neutron, uh, really good, um, E.T., uh, it's nice that the Blu-ray has the original version, um, I like this version, but, I mean, I prefer the original version, so, can't wait to get my hands on that, uh, The Terminator, love this case, which shows the Terminator, then Schwarzenegger, Terminator, Schwarzenegger, Terminator, Schwarzenegger, then, uh, what could be better than The Terminator? Why, James Cameron's best movie, Terminator 2. And, yes, you notice right there, I do have Terminator Salvation. Uh, I personally like it better than T3, but, um, it doesn't hold up well to me, and... But it is nice to get something different. Uh, the 
Shrek movies. Shrek. And uh, Shrek 2. I like Shrek 2 better than Shrek 1. Shrek, Shrek, Shrek. Shrek. I like saying Shrek. Um, <clears throat> Bruce Almighty. Um, really funny movie. Um, I hated Evan Almighty, but I heard rumors that they're actually making an official sequel. Chime in. Let you know about that, guys. Um, the Sam Raimi Spider Man movies. And yes, as you saw, I have Spider Man. As you see, I have Spider Man 3. I don't care, but I don't, I don't love it, but I don't hate it like other people. Um, and obviously, I've done reviews for these when The Amazing Spider Man came out, so go check those. They'll be, those links will be in the description box. Um, and then the Marvel Cinematic Universe, uh, my holy series after Star Wars ended, or until Avatar gets going, uh, Iron Man, um, Iron Man 2, which a lot of people seem to shit on, I don't know why, um, <clears throat> The Incredible Hulk, which <clears throat> actually got better, the was better the second time I saw it, uh, Thor, which I noticed a lot of, that most of the people who hate Thor are men, don't know why that is, but I have a theory. And then uh, my second favorite, no, my third favorite, next to Iron Man and the Avengers, uh, Captain America, the first Avenger. Um, yeah, really, really adore these movies. I'm looking forward to Iron Man 3, Thor the Dark World, and Captain America, the Winter Soldier. Then Alien, Ridley Scott Masterpiece, and a dude like Prometheus. And then what could be better, uh, like... For Terminator, what could be better than Alien? Well, how about Aliens, directed by James Cameron? Uh, Predator. As you saw in my rear window, I may, I quote, I borrowed a quote from Predator. Um, Get to the shot, oh! That's not the quote, but whatever. I just, I just felt like saying that. The Simpsons movie on DVD. The last time I tried to do Professor Frank's voice, I made it sound like a hillbilly. Whatever. Uh, my absolute favorite horror movie of all time, Jaws. It comes out on Blu-ray next Tuesday, actually, so... Going to get that. Not the minute it comes out, the second it comes out. Um, Peter Jackson's King Kong. Um, a lot of people don't like it. Mainly because of Jack Black, or in a friend of mine's case, the length, but... I, don't know, I still think it's a. Real, I think it's one of the best remakes out there. Um, <clears throat> this is a show I grew up on. Ed, Ed and Eddie. Uh, back then, Cartoon Network. This in the golden age of Cartoon Network. This was the greatest. This was my absolute favorite show of that era, along with Dexter's Lab, um, Samurai Jack, and occasionally Powerpuff Girls. That's right. I said it. What do you want? But yeah, uh, Cartoon Network really doesn't have that much good stuff. I know, his Adventure Times Cartoon Network? Let me know in the comments if it is, because I'm sure it is. But I haven't seen that show, so I really can't comment, but I know a lot of people love that show. I might give it a shot someday. Uh, Simpsons Christmas compilation. Um, only watch this during Christmas. Uh, Transformers Prime, Season 1, which, uh... Later on, I'm gonna make a series of videos on how I'm not a Transformers hypocrite because, as longtime subscribers will know, that I have three Transformers the Ride videos on my YouTube account. And then the video after the next one is a review of Transformers 2 saying how much is a piece of shit, but I'll get into that later. Uh, Star Wars The Clone Wars. Um, the series kind of went downhill, but I don't know. The first season's. I like the first season. I haven't watched much of the series afterwards, but. God, any episode with Jar Jar Banks and it sucks. Um, community. This was my life uh, before I transferred to UC Santa Cruz. I was a community college student, and what's funny was uh, the same the time season one was airing. Um, how the study group was taking Spanish one first half of the season, then Spanish two the second half. I was taking Spanish one and two the exact same time they were. It's so creepy, but it's true. <laughs> Uh, this, but the show is, looks like it seems running into problems, so I hope it doesn't get cancelled. Uh, Modern Family, um, really, probably, if there's a, ever a show to tie with Community for Funniest Show on TV, it's this show. I mean, 
I laugh hard at this show. It is so, so funny. Uh, oh, the Big Bang Theory, which the first three seasons are good, but something happens in the third season where I just stop watching the series and it's like, okay, I hate this show. But, I don't know, I don't know the first two seasons are still really funny and they... I think this was... I think this show marked the point when us nerds can, um rise where because back then it was like nerds would always get beat up at school and stuff but now the nerds are taking over we are in charge now sorry about that it took for me forever to put them in um oh yeah, i forgot about this one uh fast and the furious on the fast and the furious on blu-ray um didn't see fast five or fast and furious but i heard mixed things about fast four fast and furious but i heard fast five is really good so try to see that when i can and then uh Family Guy, something, 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 Dark Side. Um, trying to get the whole Family Guy Star Wars spoof trilogy when I can, but whatever. Uh, the two Walking with Dinosaur documentaries, uh, Walking with Dinosaurs and Allosaurus. Um, really good, um, even though the effects seem outdated. And then uh, Wallace and Gromit, the four short films. Uh, Wallace and Gromit, of course, genius. Um, that's all for my shelf. Uh, now let's see what's on top of it. Sorry about that. It took me forever to put them in. Um, oh yeah, I forgot about this one. Uh, Fast and the Furious. On, the Fast and the Furious on Blu-ray. Um, didn't see Fast Five or Fast and Furious, but I heard mixed things about Fast Four, Fast and Furious. But I heard Fast Five is really good, so try to see that when I can. And then uh, Family Guy, something, 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 Dark Side. Um, Trying to get the whole Family Guy Star Wars spoof trilogy when I can, but whatever. Uh, the two Walking with Dinosaur documentaries, uh, Walking with Dinosaurs and Allosaurus, um, really good, um, even though the effects seem outdated. And then uh, Wallace and Gromit, the four short films, uh, Wallace and Gromit, of course, genius. Um, that's all for my shelf, uh, now let's see what's on top of it.